Ram 1500 2016 or Nissan Titan 2006 Ram versus Nissan Good morning guys Johnny with Blazer Grass Lawn Care. Hope you guys are having a wonderful morning. So I'm bringing you guys along with me. Um, I guess, let me put this right here. Let me see the little hole. There you go. Um, so I only have two properties that I personally am going to hit up today. See, I got my my sweat on today, guys. You know why? Because it's like, I want to say it's 45. Yeah, it's 45. So, and it's supposed to be 65 today, but it's 45 right now. And man, woo, it's cold. Nah. <laughs> All right. Yeah, so I'm bringing you guys along, guys, just to kind of show you that every day is not a uh, a hard day you know when you have certain customers and your job is basically uh, just to maintain their property you know a lot of customers want their property just to be uh, just to look good you know what I mean during the winter time especially it depends on what neighborhood your um you're servicing so yeah that's what we're gonna do today oh, I hate this. and I'm taking the Titan yeah you know what guys and I'm gonna say this and I know you know again this is what it's all about right being honest with you guys I'm gonna tell you right now some of you guys are not gonna like this when I say it you're not gonna like it guys so get ready for it. Guess what? The Titan, the Nissan Titan, which is a 2006 with 119,000 miles, right? Pulls this trailer, which is a seven by 16, double axle, better than that. Yep, better than my 2016 Dodge Ram. You know what it is? It's the freaking transmission, man. When I pull my, my, my trailer with this truck, uh, my first, I guess it's the first gear. It just takes so long to, think, to get into second. You know, once, it, once it's in second, then okay, I'm good to go. But it's like, this joker, the first gear is like, it, 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 it's a little bit scary. I don't know why. You know, you have that. And then you're like, come on, man, get into gear. Get into gear, get into gear. And once it gets into gear, then, you know, we're good to go. You know? So... I'm not a truck guy, you know what I mean? I'm not one of those guys that into specification in trucks. You know, I'm one of those guys that'll buy a truck because it looks good. I'm not one of those guys that'll buy a truck because of the engine and all that good stuff. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I know the basics, but I'm not one of those technical guys, you know what I mean? Like go into the, you know, the VA 5.6 liter and blah, 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 blah. No, I want something that's gonna pull my freaking trailer and don't give me a headache so yes I've said it I've said it and I know I'm on, I'm on, <laughs> I'm on a little rant here the 2006 Nissan Titan 5.6 SC pulls my trailer better than my 2016 Ram and again it's just because of the first gear now this one rides extremely extremely comfortable you know what this is one of those trucks that looks good and it drives good and it does everything good 
Like if you were a city person and you want just want a truck, this baby is it, beautiful. Gas mileage, outstanding, on a highway, I love it. But when it comes to pulling this trailer, the Titan does a better job. I said it guys, I said it. I know I'm gonna get it in the comments, but that's what I want. I want you guys to voice your opinion in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> and don't tell me go buy another truck. It's not gonna happen, guys. Okay. And don't tell me I should have gotten uh, 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 a 2500 or, or a 3500. I have a 1500. Okay. That's what I have. <laughs> All right, man. Enough is enough. Let me uh, take my ass on and go do these two properties. But yeah, I want to bring you guys along with me just to show you that every day is that a hard day. And believe it or not, I only have two properties. Well, me, I have two properties today. And I'm gonna to take it out there. I'm gonna I'm I'm take you and just show you what I have to do, guys. And man, it's so easy. It's simple, small yards. I'm gonna blow, you, you'll see, all right, stand by. So let me get my phone. These are the two properties that I'm going to service today. Oh, not this. This one right here. All I gotta do is blow it. And this one. And we got some winter weeds that I just sprayed last week, so they're starting to die. So I'm going to just blow and not even mess with those. I want the uh, the selective herbicide to kind of get into the roots and get rid of that. All right, let's keep it moving. This is gonna be a, a lot of blowing, so I'll just show you the end result, okay? And again, you don't wanna just watch me blow, right? You wanna see what it looks like at the end, and then uh, we'll keep it moving. All right, so I finish this one. Again, like I said before, we're ready to spray this. And I finish this one. All right, so like I said before, guys, basically all I do is uh, come once a week and just, uh, you know, blow the property off, <sighs> keep it clean, and uh, yeah, that's about it. And they, um, so you know, they, they pay the same amount every month um and it is uh debited from their uh from the credit card all right guys uh don't forget put your comments below in regards to the trucks have a blessed one 
See you on the next one. Pop smoke. Peace.